Take one, scene one. So I'm afraid this video is just going to be a load of hot air. So while I'm working on my next big project, I thought I'd make this video just to show you what I've been up to. See, I recently got this miniature welding kit, which uses bottled oxygen and propane to get up to around 2000 degrees centigrade. Now, while it's great to have and a super useful tool, it also allows me to try something that I've been wanting to do for a while. See, what I have here is just some run-of-the-mill flexible vinyl tubing. Now, if you try and burn this stuff in air, it's really difficult to get it to ignite. But something strange happens when you burn it in an atmosphere of nearly 100% oxygen. It lights up immediately and burns with a white hot flame. It just goes to show how much of a difference enough oxygen can make. So this is the hybrid rocket motor I'm going to make. The basic idea is that oxygen gas is blown from here, through the fuel and out the nozzle. The nice thing about this engine is that unlike normal solid fuel engines, the thrust can be throttled simply by increasing or decreasing the amount of oxygen going in. Once you've got oxygen flowing, you just need a wick to light the fuel and you're away. So I took those designs and I've machined this out of aluminium. You can see here that the chamber and the nozzle are one piece, and then in the back here I've drilled out a space for where the fuel can go. Now, I'm not too worried about fastening it too much or about making all of this airtight because the compression ratio isn't high enough to be getting any noticeable thrust off this thing. It's more of a proof of concept and seeing if it will work rather than about seeing if it can actually provide enough thrust to be useful. Right, I guess we better go and try it then. I'll put this together, hook it up to the vise and we'll give it a light.